Hey everybody, no intro today. This is gonna be a, a short video. And we really debated whether or not to even upload anything about this or not, or how we were gonna deal with this or what we were gonna do. But we have some, uh, we have some really kind of, uh, some bad news. We've been, it's been a rough week. And Ginger and I have both, we filmed videos, I've filmed videos, and Ginger's filmed videos. We couldn't bring ourselves to upload anything. But Ginger filmed one video that I think uh, kind of explains what's been going on, why we haven't uploaded a video in over a week, and what we've been going on uh, doing with our lives, and uh, why we've needed to take a little bit of time just to think about what we're doing and where things are going. And <clears throat> we didn't know how to get started again. You know, with YouTube, when we when we decided we were going to take a break from it for a little while, it's been really hard to pick up the camera again and just kind of uh, move on and just keep being fam damnly and just keep going and 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 everything. But we we're doing really good. Uh, everything is going really well. We're really happy. We have some awesome plans for fam damnly. We have awesome plans with uh, Gingerific and everything that's going on there. Um, uh, my old Lancelot channel, I think I'm, I'm making some changes. I'm going to get back out of the video game stuff and the, the weight loss stuff. I'm getting back on track, but we've got so much stuff going on right now. And I think uh, before I ramble on too long, just know that we're doing good and where everything is going really well. It's been a really difficult week and neither of us really wanted to make any videos about what's been going on in our lives and how difficult it is. But Ginger did make one video and... <laughs> Kyle's in the bath right now, so I gotta go help him, but um, Ginger did film one video a week ago, and it's a difficult video. She's really putting her heart out there, so just bear with it, and don't feel, uh, I don't know, it is what it is. I'm not gonna tell you how to feel or what to think or anything, but we wanna share our lives with you guys the good, the bad, the ugly, whatever's going on, and just let you guys know what's going on. So uh, without further ado, this is a video clip that Ginger filmed uh, last week, and I think I think it really captures the experience of what we've been going through for the last week. And then just know that we're doing really good, that this was filmed a week ago, and we've taken time as a family, and we're doing really good. So uh, without saying any more, here's a clip from last week that Ginger filmed. Love you guys. Hey guys. I just sat down on a wet patio chair. <laughs> it rained last night. Um, the, this is a really hard video to make right now. Um, I started bleeding and so I rushed to the doctor and um, the doctor was like, oh, don't be concerned. You know, right off the bat, she was like, don't be concerned. You know, a lot of people spot in the first trimester and it's no big deal and you're just spotting, so don't worry about it. That's never happened to me before. Well, one other time when I did miscarry, my very first pregnancy, I miscarried. And so I was like, okay, everything's all right, you know, because of course you get alarmed when, when you start spotting. It's a major sign. Any Anytime during pregnancy, it's not to be taken lightly. And so I rushed into the, to the doctor and she was like, it's all good. We're just gonna take an ultrasound. We should be able to at least see the baby um, and see the heartbeat. I don't know if we can hear it. And I was like, okay, that's cool. Um, so she tried the heartbeat first. We couldn't hear it. It wasn't a big deal. We did the ultrasound and there was no heartbeat. So um, the baby died. And it, it's been gone for like two weeks. It just it quit growing so they could tell just how far along I was. Um, Any time during pregnancy when you lose a baby, whether it's the beginning or the middle, I can imagine that it's hard. I've only lost him in the beginning. But I haven't had any trouble. I had all three of my boys right in a row and it was no problem. So I felt comfortable just telling everybody and everything. We debated whether or not to tell anybody for over a week. We were just like, should we just not say anything? And I was like, I haven't had any trouble carrying babies. I don't 
I don't see why we shouldn't, we shouldn't just tell everybody, you know? And, um, so that's my bad on my part, I guess, for telling everybody, but we were so excited. We just wanted to share it. That's what these vlogs are. They're our life every day or, you know, as much as we can. And we want to document it. And sometimes it's not all peaches and cream, you know? And I guess we could leave it out, you know? I could have just tweeted, hey, we lost the baby or whatever. But I just wanted you guys to know that it's okay. I have three great kids. Um, it was a surprise. Um, it was a good surprise. We were really, really excited. But it's just kind of the way it goes. And any woman, I've almost, I've hardly known one single woman that hasn't had a miscarriage at some time. It's part of it. It's part of being a mom. It's part of wanting to have kids. Mis having a miscarriage to me is part of it. You know, it's bound to happen. It's likely to happen to you at least once. And, you know, I'm extremely healthy. You know, I don't drink alcohol, I don't do drugs, I've never smoked, I've never, you know, I mean, it's just, it just happens. And there's no explanation. And, you know, we are facing the fact that Carl had a vasectomy, so I've gone from pregnant to probably not ever having another child. And that's, that's a little hard. Because it's all, your perception of the world is your psyche. You know, it's, it's what, it's how you perceive your life. And before we got pregnant with this baby, I was fine with it. I was like, yeah, I'm done. I'm, I'm cool with not having any more kids, you know. We have three awesome, healthy kids. We're ready to move on with our careers and raise the ones that we have and make a good life for them. But I'm a mom and I love being a mom. So to have, so to get pregnant unexpectedly, I was happy. <laughs> You know, I was happy and it was, it took some adjusting in my mind and stuff like that. But once you make that adjustment and I felt like I was barely getting my head wrapped around it, it kind of comes to a screeching halt. So anyways, I just want to let you guys know we're really, really, really disappointed. And I don't know what our path will be next. Um, but you're along for the ride. So... Anyway, we'll see you guys later.